280 yards. Playing his second shot here at the par five. Frank, at this the highest level, stroke play, really it seems to me to be all about not wasting shots because the margin for error is so razor thin. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Good swing, good shot yet again. Good chance now for a birdie. That was an outstanding play. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. Just a couple of feet. Needs a few more of those. That was a good birdie. Yeah, this time, that one gets them in the top ten. On to the eighth. It's a par three, 203 yards. What's going on here, Frank? Interesting par three, really. It, it, it looks anything other than a straightaway hole. That bunker... Short of this green gives you like an optical illusion. You think it's lapping up with the front of this green, but there's actually you know, sort of three or four yards before you get to the putting surface. Um, a little bit of a drop off behind this green, and it narrows out the deeper the green gets. So uh, a tricky little par three. one starting down the right does not look like it's going to draw back towards the flag but it will catch the green Frank had hit the green but just didn't have enough backspin it, uh, you wonder what he's thinking on that second shot solid play heart of the green and getting ready for the putt. So close, just a tap in from there. Just a tap in to finish the hole. Frank, they didn't have any openings at uh, EA Sports Basketball because, I mean, this is just brutal to watch. Frank, looking at this par 5 ninth hole, it's 621 yards. I need to make birdie here. What's the best way to go about it? Well, if you're a long hitter, then there's a chance you can reach this par 5 and 2, Rich. But really, the best way to make birdie here, good tee shot, and then contemplate the layup in between the first two bunkers. There's a nice section of fairway, and that's not going to leave you much in for that third shot to a green that's very receptive. So really, birdie can be made the hard way. Wedge and a putt. They'll be pretty happy with that 290-yard poke off the tee. Looks like he's going to have a go at it here at the par 5. His second shot.
Chance to get it close here. This one looks like it's headed right for the middle of the dance floor, Frank. Rather nice shot, I would say. Strong approach shot here at the ninth. And a good opportunity to finish this side with a birdie. You get the sense now with that birdie that our young star so explosive is setting himself up for a big weekend run. EA Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live second-round coverage of the BioWare Classic. Hello again and welcome. Rich Lauder alongside my colleague Frank Nabolo for EA Sports. Getting set to go at the Wetlands Golf and Country Club. We're located along the St. John's River in the great state of Florida. On to the par 4 sixth here at the Wetlands. And Frank, how does that water factor into the way you play this hole? It bisects this fairway beautifully, Rich. Uh, 233 yards to the run out on the first section of fairway. And that might be worth considering for the short hitters to try and flash it across the narrowest part of those wetlands. 276 yards. And of course, the more horsepower you got, actually the easier this tee shot becomes. Missed that one, and it is going towards the rough. You have to think he'll be happy with that, given that it looked like it was headed right for the rough. Yeah, it looked like that was the only place it was going to finish. But, um, well, <clears throat> it's a little bit unexplainable. Let's see what he does from here now. Lucky break.
Good looking shot right here. Oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Made par yesterday. This one for birdie. Starting to move on this leaderboard now, Frank. It's got a nice look to it. Another who's who.